the story of an outcast, now a hunted wanderer over the face of the globe. She lived life to the full, and in her wake, she left a trail of broken men. Now a fugitive, battered and beaten, she spends her numbered days in a miserable hideout. You all know her name, Anopheles Annie, the malaria mosquito. To look at me now, you wouldn't hardly believe it. But back in the good old days, I was really some stuff. Yeah, it was a cinch for a gal to get along when I was young and good looking. But times have changed. Why, well, I used to be the toast of the hot spots, queen of the swamps. The world was my playground, the South Pacific, India, North Africa, Italy, yep, all over the world. I knocked them on their eels. I took my drink straight, but the boys got theirs mixed with a Mickey Finn. My percentages was going up when the big shots turned on the heat. It was the same old vice squad that made it hot for me down in Panama. Parasitologists, entomologists, malariologists, every damnedologist in the country got on my trail. And I do mean trail. They started a cleanup. First, they wise the boys up. off with Paris Green. They busted in all the joints from Burma to Bizerti. The racket's getting tougher. The percentages ain't what it used to be, but thanks to Snafu, a smart operator can still sneak in for a one-night stand. Pipe the torso. Look at those knees. He don't care where he goes. He's wide open. Repellent? <laughs> he never touches the stuff. And that goes for the atabreen, too. <laughs> As long as that guy's around, a little gal can still make an honest living. Oh. 